good day. We are here to share the proper way of operating and maintaining the Roy generator set open frame with model RGS019000. Each generator set comes with the following accessories. Please check if the accessories are complete. Now, let us start with the installation of push wheel set and feet support. Put the rod on the wheel, then mount it on the hole located at the bracket body and fix the clamp on the end side. Slant the position of the portable generator. Next, put the feet support on the bottom bracket and fix with screws and nuts. Then place the handle position and secure the lock before use. Have the following products on hand. Using the funnel, fill up the unit with engine oil up to the maximum level. Use the dipstick to measure properly. Afterwards, fill up the unit with gasoline and secure the lock on gasoline cap. Before starting up the portable generator, familiarize yourself of the following parts. To start it up, ensure that all the buttons on the control panel of the portable generator are turned off, including circuit breaker. Next turn on the fuel valve, then pull the choke valve switch to close position. For electric start, tap first the battery, then turn the key to the start position till the engine starts. While for manual start, turn the engine switch into on then pull the starter handle slowly. To operate, insert the generator plug to operate on specific loads, then turn on the breaker to provide the necessary power on the specific loads. After use, turn off the breaker, pull the plug, and pull the choke valve switch to open position. For product maintenance, starting with changing of engine oil, remove the oil fill cap or dipstick. Tilt the generator to drain the old oil completely. Refill with the recommended oil type and amount. Check the oil level by using the dipstick and then close the cap after measuring. Next, cleaning of air filter. Remove the air filter cover. Take out the air filter element. Clean it with soapy water if it's a foam filter. Allow it to dry completely before reinstalling. Reassemble the air filter and cover. Lastly, cleaning the spark plug. Remove the spark plug wire. Use a spark plug wrench to remove the spark plug. Inspect the spark plug for wear or deposits. Clean or replace it as necessary. Reinstall the spark plug. And connect the spark plug wire. 